Here we are guys, looking at a wild T-Rex in its natural habitat. So, hey guys, what's up? And uh, we're back, it's another recording obviously. I'm guessing you guessed that by the fact that this is on YouTube. Oh god, I struggle with myself sometimes. As you know, we are back on the server. The guy did get a... Uh, it sorted out with the farming and stuff and the spawn rates i think i did add that into the last video while editing it but yes um we're back this is arc episode eight we're doing awesome we're mashing out these videos and we're halfway for a metal run i've literally just grabbed a little bit of metal literally put a load on the go up there cooking so it'll be metal ingots and then we've got another 250 metal ingots on that guy carrier pigeon 100 obsidian and 100 crystal just to restock our supplies and stuff just gonna give you a heads up uh, I have joined Adventure Co the uh, other tribe that I've been there you go as you can see the other tribe that I've been playing with uh, Erratics and uh, Mac the guys that have been in their house video are in there and uh, met someone who's got a mic he's awesome he's called DK Dark Knight uh, he's pretty sick and he will hopefully be joining us in this video today and he's a really cool dude so yeah and you'll be able to hit hear him and stuff he doesn't mind being in a video so it's gonna be cool but guys um i'm just gonna say for a second that's the wrong button uh, thank you guys for um watching this video and th i'll be really appreciative if you hit that like and subscribe button cause it really does help helps the channel it helps me while I'm put out some more videos so yes guys that is just wanted to say that um, basically what we're going to be doing is today we're going to be putting a load more walls up around the uh, base with a little twist you'll see when the time comes but now I'm joking um, and that will be happening and then hopefully we will actually be taming something as well I don't know yet maybe maybe not and we will be doing a mail run so that's going to be awesome, we've got a load of gear and when we go back to base, uh, I don't know if you can see, it's kind of uh, transparent I've got on me right now I have two guns in my hotbar and you're thinking Phil, why do you have two guns in your hotbar? and it's because I've created one gun for bullets with the scope on it and then I have a second gun which actually have trank darts on it which I uh, unlock the engram to, which is awesome they're kind of expensive to be honest let me just find them for you there they go and they're really expensive but it's awesome also the owner of the servers added a couple of mods in which is awesome he got um, the stairs mod which we had on the old server before we came to the server and you remember Maclebuzz? turned out Maclebuzz made that mod which is uh, really really awesome because he's a cool dude as you guys know and yeah we've got the metal railings mod which is furthermore even awesomer as well and everything's just awesome he's added a couple more things but we haven't got the mods on here like we did have last time with the uh arc reborn and everything but it's still awesome as you guys know it's just building stuff and that kind of thing but yeah hope you guys do like this episode uh we'll be back in a few well half sec for you and we'll be doing something Maybe build in a little montage. Maybe we'll be back with Dark Knight. I don't know. Do 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 do. But you guys, I'll see you in a second. Remember, have an awesome day. Boo so guys, we're back. Uh, we're just going to put the metal in the furnace here. As you can see, we're very overburdened and can't move an inch. So if we dismount at the wrong part, we're gonna gonna have to throw the metal on the floor and then. Do stuff. Let's see if we can spin back round. We always dismount on the right. Always. Always. Watch. Go. Dismount me on the left. No, it didn't. It dismounted me on the right. You know why I did that? Because me and I'm awesome. No, guys. I'm joking. Basically, uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to stick that on. Grab the 100 spark powder out of here. And do that. Let me just show you something. As you can see here, this is what I was on about uh, by the dark gun. And then I do have my bullet gun, obviously, with the scope. You cannot have a scope on a dark gun, which is kind of sad. But yes, that's just how it is. 
Still got everything out, obviously, the level 26 Bronto and everything, I won't go leveling up. As you can see, Air Force One is 2 to 8, which is awesome, because we killed a level, um, I was like, level 40 Alpha Raptor, which gave me a load of levels and this guy a load of levels. We've got Carrier Pigeon up to 116, uh, which is awesome, because we got a decent amount of weight on him right now. I'll be putting up more, he's already up to 628, but... I want to tell you guys about something. I found out yesterday, uh, when, why am I putting them up here? When the guy fixed the um, spawn rates, he actually increased the level that you can find while dino dinos at. So, you know, we got our uh, Air Force One at max dino wild level 120. He's now put that up to 240. So, we are going to be finding wild 240 dinos, which we will have to kill. We have to kill them guys but before we do any of that before we go out and tame some beasts or something like that what we're gonna do is go replace um at, do this wall a little bit and uh as you can see we've got no loo walls but they're not like the normal walls no they're stone in fact they're not stone walls they're stone behemoth gates let me just represent this to you that's them these is what we've got and uh, as you can see we've got 10 of them yeah our base is suddenly getting considerably bigger uh, basically what happened is DK Dark Knight actually made these for us while we're offline today which is awesome he's an awesome dude and well that's what we're going to be doing right now so guys we're going to do a little montage destroying all these guys replacing them might be kind of a longer montage that I normally do. Add some music as always. And yes guys. Uh, we'll see you in a sec. Hope you're enjoying the video. Boodoo. Montage time. And guys, we are back. I just thought I'd bring you back for this. Uh, as you can see, we're getting a load of wood back off this. A decent amount, actually. And a decent amount of stone as well, to be honest, which is pretty cool. I'm getting like 200 back already and a load of wood, which is uh, obviously the best thing. So we've deleted all them. And uh, now I'm going to place all the stone behemoth gates, which we do have gates to as well. Which is awesome, and this should cover all the way around to like about there. I just thought I'd knock them down out, and well, let's keep going on with the montage. See you in a sec. Doo doo. And guys, we are back. As you can see, I've placed all those behemoth gates. Uh, I was kind of retarded with the placing, so we're going to have to build some walls to kind of put them back up, which is going to be fun. But uh, as you know, it's doing pretty awesome. I haven't put the gates up yet, we'll just do that in a second. But uh, I need to put all this wood away. It's got to the level where he can't hold anymore. And he got 
couple of hundred stone, 300, 400 stone, that's good as well. But yes, guys, as you can see, this is awesome now. It makes the uh, base look tiny. But it's alright, because at some point we will be moving to a new base. I'm just going to run around, not montage this, because it's not going to take long to throw down these gates, to be honest. And yeah, big shout out to uh, DK for doing this, because it's awesome. But yeah, as you can see, uh, I literally went over all terrain, leaving massive gaps. So yeah, I'll probably, I am going, never mind, I'm probably going to, I am going to uh, fill that up with fences. And yeah, so we've got a little offline base there, that's basically where I go to sleep. But we're back in a sec when uh, I've got all this pin coded because obviously it's going to take some time. Hope you guys do uh, did like that little montage. We'll be back in a sec. And uh, yeah. Do do. And guys, what's up? We're back. We've got them all pin coded and painted blue as you can see. And uh, we got the walls under most of them. Yes, the walls do look like shit. I know, they will... It's not the easiest and most flattest land. Look at this. Look at this. I could place a whole other gate under there for God's sake. But yes. I know guys. Some more walls will have to be put down. And they do look terrible. Walls here. I know. Everywhere. But. It's what we've got for now. And it's big improvement from what it was. Um, as you can see. There's a wall missing there. And there was an extra wall on that side. But those thatch foundations below it. And when I deleted the thatch foundation, for some reason it deleted the uh, behemoth gate as well, which I'm not too sure about. I don't know why that happened, but I'm just kind of dealing with it, guys, as you do, you know. Let's throw this guy down here. I don't want to pick up stone. There we go. Just drop that. I've just got some metal out of the furnace, and that's not too bad. Let's upgrade this guy. Health, 712 health for a Dimorphodon's pretty sick. So, uh, Adillo actually came in and tried to attack us. That's why, uh, everything's messed up and I'm inside a mammoth. But yeah, that's why everything's kind of wacky with the dinosaurs right now. So, I'm just backing this guy up. And then I'll put Sturdy back into his position. But yes, guys, we are doing awesome. DK hasn't come on right now, sadly. Hopefully, it will be at some point because uh, we're about to do the metal run and I'll be cutting out the uh, stuff and things in that. We'll be cutting out the traveling in that, so that'll be pretty cool. Let's get off this guy and we'll move this guy back up. But yeah, hope you guys are liking this video so far. Sorry, uh, there's quite a lot of skips in this one. But yes, and we're overweight, that's why we can't move. Um, I'm going to go deposit this metal, then we're going to do a little metal run, and uh, yeah, or we might do some taming, I don't know, guys, we'll be back, whether, uh, whether I'll be on top of a mountain, or aiming at something, with a gun and lag, almighty Jesus lag, there we go, um, we've got a load of metal, we're back up to 800 now, nearly, Doing awesome metal wise, we're pretty good. And uh, yeah, guys, we will be back in a sec when we're doing stuff basically. See you guys in a sec. Have fun and do do. Here we are, guys, looking at a wild T Rex in its natural habitat. This is a furious battle where this mighty predator might just lose because he's level 16. And that's a level 100 and. Come on, 128 Puma Scorpius. But guys, this might be the end for this faithful T-Rex. And this is just a sad day. I must go save him. Oh God. <laughs> guys, we're back. No, he died. But we will avenge him. No, I'm, I'm joking, guys. Basically, I just thought I'll bring you back. Uh, we're looking for stuff to tame here. And uh, I just thought I'll bring you back. So if watch a little bit of leveling 
for this guy if we can hit this boomer Scorpius. Jesus Christ. Level 16, is that it? No, we're going in for the big game. Let's just attack everything. Charge. For we will avenge this dear soul. Don't get in the water, it'll throw me off. I don't like being thrown off. Kill everything. D damn. And that's killing everything. Jesus Christ. And this, guys, is how you kill everything in your way that even breathes. <laughs> how to win at the game, guys. Get a level 200 and some uh, RG. And that was a level 233 uh, Sabertooth. Damn. Is that guy still alive? Let's just make sure and kill him. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> You've been watching my vids, obviously. As you know, last time I did ask what music you guys want. Menigo. Oh, okay. So, uh, this is Erratic. Um, <laughs> sorry, I forgot his name there. Let's invite him to a call. See if he can join. He's been having some problems. And that's loud. You there, man? Hello? <laughs> Silence on the video. No, I'm joking. He's typing. Let's just move that to the side so I can play and see. No, no, I can't hear you, man, sadly. Damn! Who want this guy? Hello? <laughs> Are you sure? Um, click on you see the speaker, no, the microphone, like next to uh, where the speaker is, where your voice is coming out. Look at the microphone and click on that and change settings. Hopefully, we could get this guy in because he's pretty cool, dude. But we're gonna kill this T Rex and these mammoths because, yeah, we're awesome. Too easy. Oh, this guy ain't dead. Oh, yeah, he was. <laughs> but damn. Right, dude, I'll be back in a sec. I'm recording right now. We'll get you set and sorted out in a second, okay? I'm just gonna exit the call. Right, guys, just ending the call here. That is a very, very loud bit of snow there. Bit of snow. Jesus Christ. I've got my gamma turned up just so you can see. Nah. Alright, let's go back here. And uh, basically, I just wanted to cut back in quickly before I destroyed all that stuff. Um, I just wanted to show off the clan base I'm in, Adventure Co. They're awesome. You should join this server, guys. Just thought I'd throw it out there. Because then you could create a rival clan and rise up against us. Or maybe even join our clan if you want to. It's up to the owner. It's not my clan. But yeah. You know. Doing some stuff. I just want to show you around here. They've got uh, giant stone walls. Behemoth gates around here. And um, this is the clan base as such. They've got a load of dinosaurs in there. And even a couple of quetzals which is awesome. As you can see here. That's a new base just been built. Um, this is the clan base as such. This is where clan loot is kept Which uh, is pretty awesome base Got some refrigerators a load of stuff a load of chests and that kind of thing a little bit of FPS lag there and Obviously we have our species X plants around here and uh, a gigantopithecus Which is awesome. Oh, I Can't upgrade him. He's not mine. No Okay, that's a uh, thing. As you got, as you can see, there's some high level T Rex over here, 273, which is awesome. But what we're going to do, we're just going to have a look at bases. This, um, this is Mando's base. I'll get the bird quickly so you can have a little look from the air. See how awesome it is. It's an awesomely built base. The uh, style of it is just 
damn cool to be honest. Damn, my gamma. Let's turn that down to 3.5. There you go, it's a little bit better for you guys, hopefully. And yeah, can you see this base? It is awesome how he's built it and everything. How cool does that look, guys? How cool does that look? You can see it there, it's just awesome. He's got all the ramps everywhere, it's proper slanted and stuff. Loads better. This is the owner of the sub, by the way, Falk. He's awesome, he's a boss, he gets everything done pretty fast. So yeah, he was just checking the spawning stuff. <laughs> but yes guys, remember, do join this server, it is pretty cool. And yeah. Let's have a look at this base, see what we're gonna do. Oh, he's just started it, I think. Might be some out. Weird, a pen maybe, a taming pen, I don't know. But anyway guys, we will be back in a sec. I just wanted to give you a little uh, loving around this new base. It's pretty awesome, this new clan. The amount of dinosaurs I've got, as you can see, is purely mental. But yes, it's awesome. But uh, what was I saying? Being stupid. But, but, but. We'll be back in a second, guys, obviously. And yeah, see you guys in a sec. And guys, we are back, spectating. Oh, I can't do it this time, I've had enough. Um, as you can see, there's level 88 Kano down there, which uh, I'm thinking I want to tame. So, let me just check which one the level 88 one is, the red one or the uh, greeny coloured one. It is the red one, so we can kill the greeny coloured one, which is kind of good. I can show off my new gun, which uh, is good, pretty awesome if he stands still. Oh wow, son, is that how it is? Just gonna throw light everywhere, huh? Let's try and... Watch, watch, da 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 No, I'm joking, guys. I don't know whether I need to attack him. I could just take him out of my bird. No point wasting ammo. So, uh, what we gonna do? We go down there. We're gonna Shrek this guy. Tame the other guy. And be the boss. No, I'm joking. I'm sorry. It happens. Um, if you're asking why we're taming a Kano, it's because uh, I want to. Can't say it any more simple than that. I just want one. As you can see, we've got 31 bullets here in our trank rifle. I don't know if our trank rifle will actually reach from here. No, I don't think it did. So, guys, we are. Oh, FPS lag. We are going to have to get in his ass. We are going to have to... Uh, oh god, I don't know why I said that. We'll go go down there. Let's go on this rock, hopefully. Jump off. Put this guy to passive. He is on passive. He is on passive. And uh, we can show you the Trank gun now. It's kind of a little showcase kind of thing here, if we can uh, get on a rock to hide, because uh, it's Kano and it will knock me out like a beast. It's a magic Kano that disappeared. Ah, oh, there it is. <laughs> you know you're scared when a magic Kano appears. Did we miss it? Surely we hit it. Oh, I think we hit it. Oh yeah, we hit it. Oh god, don't freeze on me game, I'm running away from level 88 car now. Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Leave me, sir. Come on, this might take some time to knock this guy out, but obviously, this is kind of stuff you guys want to watch. Watch you attack it. And that's why you shouldn't tame with a little bit of lag, guys. I don't know why I'm getting so much lag today. We are putting a decent amount of tranquilizers in them. He's got Torpor, we know that one. Because these Trank Darts do three times the Tranquilizer power as a uh, Narco Arrow. So, yeah, it kind of gives you a little bit of perspective there. 
This guy's really bad at attacking. He can't hit me half the time. He looks like he's been to therapy, you know, where they stick all the needles in you. <laughs> oh, God. I, I feel you, dude. He seemed to be taking arrows good, though. And if we take any decent damage, he's down! You noob! No, JK. Let's go get the guy off the rock. Pump that guy full of uh, prime, as we do, you know. And we have already got the saddle for him, I believe, which is awesome. It's him there, isn't it? Of course it is. Let's uh, grab, well, put some narcotics on him first. Get a lot of lag for some reason. Don't know why that is. Hope, I hope you get a like this little tame. I just thought I'd tame a car now. I, I don't have a reason why. Like I said, I just felt like it. Let's grab 20 meat for us just for now. Did take quite a few narco uh, uh, trank arrows, this guy. Trank darts, sorry. Sorry. But yeah, let's put the prime on this guy. Uh, he should eat in a second and we'll see what he levels up to. What's his food at? Decent food. Good health, good health. Decent melee damage, I'll be up in that. But this isn't a guy I'm going to be out on a lot. It's just some I'll ride about on. Have, have a little laugh, really. Damn, his torpor goes down fast. As you know, a narcotic regens 40 torpor. So, uh, let's bang a narcotic on this guy. Hopefully he's going to eat the, uh, prime. And we can see how much prime does. In a few seconds, at least. Let's pump that, because narcos increases how fast the, uh, food goes down. And come on. We'll be back in a sec, guys, when that's down to 50, because, uh, actually... Instead of doing that, let's just have a little wander around, see if there's any uh, bad, bad guys around here. Doesn't seem to be, but I do want to knock down a couple of these trees, because they're kind of in the way, if you know what I mean. How much did one prime do? Jesus Christ. You don't get hungry fast, do you? Two. One. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Let's see how much this prime pumps him up. That's decent. Plus 43 levels. That's awesome. That'll put him up to a 131, which is always good. Guys, we'll be back when he's fully tamed or in case something happens. And yeah, see you guys in a sec. But um. And guys, we're back. It's a sad day. See that there? That is uh, a dead T Rex, level 16. The evil thing. Came up and killed the car I was taming him. Bastard Dimorphodons. I'm trying to be sad here. And killed the car that I was taming. So. I'll just fly away. So I killed it. But sadly that means the car we were taming is dead. And it is a shame. But we'll be coming back. As ever. Better. But maybe not this episode. Because it takes way too long. <laughs> but anyway. That's what we'll be doing next episode. So guys, this will be the end of the video. Sadly, it is very all over the place. Last couple of episodes. I hope you guys did like this episode. The little montage, building the wall and everything. And yes, we'll see you guys soon in the next episode. Tomorrow, doing some more stuff. Probably taming him quite soon. See you guys in a second. Bye-bye.